welcome back to this week's vlog. It is Tuesday, October 15th. Uh, yesterday was my birthday. Shout out to my fellow Libras. I know a lot of you guys also had birthdays yesterday or around um, that day. So happy birthday to all of you Libras. Um, so yesterday I didn't do much. I studied pretty much all day. So it wasn't that cool of a birthday, but um, I did get to go to the cadaver lab because I wanted to spend some time in there. So that was actually a really nice birthday gift. Before we get started with this week's vlog, I just wanted to address some things. This week is going to be really stressful, potentially. I'm not really sure what kind of emotions it holds. <laughs> you guys know every moment is different and it's just like this so this week is assessment week so essentially we have exams all week um addressing last week's video um i know i showed a lot of emotion in that and this week um it could have you know a vast amount of emotions just because of the high stress levels this week for assessment week i knew going into posting that video that it would attract people who like to kick others when they're down and i know that's just the nature of some people's behavior and the way that they are um, but i wanted to thank you guys for being so supportive and i want to let you know that i'm okay um i just i really just show you um you know all of the moments good or bad and i promise that i'm going to keep showing you all of my emotions whether they are really happy or really sad because that's just you know life and i don't want to sugarcoat this process for you if you are interested in medical school or whatever obviously everyone is different and i want you guys to recognize that you know people handle stress in different ways and um just because you're crying doesn't mean that you're super weak that's just the way that i let out stress and in my emotions yeah let's go forward with this week shall we i have my coffee i'm gonna do some last minute prepping with my winnie the pooh practice omem on him and yes so i'll see you guys in a bit i just got to campus for my omem practical i'm really nervous uh I went over it in the car, I went over it at home. We'll see what treatment I get. I'm probably gonna get ribs because why wouldn't I get ribs? But, okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, wish me luck. Okay, bye. Okay, so I just finished my OMEP practical. It went well. Um, I did well. I got ribs, classic, right? Of course I got ribs. Why wouldn't I get ribs? Um, so, luckily I freaking did them right. So and so I'm gonna go forward. I have confidence now for the rest of the day. I have to go get ready for the SP encounter. I'm so happy. Thank God it's over. Now I have three more exams left, so happy about that. Yay! Okay, thank God. I'm so happy. Okay, this is good. This is really, really good. Okay, um, I gotta go get ready. It's 11.30. My SP encounter is in an hour and a half, so I gotta run home really quick and change. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing for CM&R. Um, I have this shirt from H&M. I have these pants from Express. They're slacks, and then I'll be wearing flats. Um, and then I also wanted to show you guys something really cool. This company called Ana Luisa reached out to me. I read about them. I did some research, and they're actually very sustainable. They only use recycled gold. They're gorgeous, like, simple pieces, right? They actually have the same jeweler as um, Tiffany and & Company, or Tiffany & Co., and then also Louis Vuitton. So... Um, and it's not as expensive. Uh, obviously, they're like really high quality pieces, but they don't mark up the prices like to this absurd amount that's unaffordable for the simple piece of jewelry. Um, their stuff comes in like this really cute drawer box. Um, I already was wearing half of the stuff they got me. I got these earrings. I thought they're really cute. Basic studs. I've been wearing them for the past week now. Very cute, right? Just like super cute. And then I'm well, I'm wearing my other pair that I got. So just some basic hoop earrings. I thought they're really cute. If you're interested in Ana Luisa, go check them out. I'm leaving a link in the description down below. And then I also have a code for you guys for 10% off. You can use the code RACHELS10 for 10% off. Really cool company. If you're interested in jewelry and nice quality pieces for an affordable price, be sure to check them out. I really like them. So, with that being said, I need to go do my patient encounter and let's kill it, guys. Woo! Okay.
Let's go. So we had the SP encounter. It went well. I finished. I was worried about like the soap note typing part because I hadn't been like finishing on time. But I finished on time. I feel so good. I'm like so relieved. So um, two down. Now with two more to go. Tomorrow's gonna be a breeze. Oh, it's so bright. And then I have anatomy. Yeah, anatomy tomorrow. Today's over. I can study now for the rest of the day. I'm so glad it's over. Okay, yes, I made it. I don't know if I put a diagnosis in my soap note, but I know I put, I put, actually I have no idea. I can't remember anything. You like just black out when you go into that clinical skills lab. You just black out. Everything is erased. Hey guys, so I've been studying forever. Um, studying with my roommate. Let's see, I took a nap because I needed one. Then I'm back to studying and I'll just be studying for the rest of the night. So it's pretty dang boring. But that's all. I just wanted to check in. Good morning, you guys. It is Wednesday. I have an anatomy practical today. So I'm excited about it just because it's fun. It's a good challenge. Um, according to our Facebook class group, not all the dissections were completed. I'm not sure if people went in to finish their dissections. If they weren't completed, the anatomist will tag the exam harder. Not that it's good to leave your bodies undissected, but it's kind of a cool challenge and it may cost me some points if they tag it really difficult, but I think it's a part of the fun to try and figure stuff out so I'm kind of excited about it okay so I'm gonna head out the door in just a second to go to the practical I'm so excited so when I study anatomy in the anatomy lab I we wear our glasses or like protective eyewear um, for the practical we don't need protective eyewear since we're not actually like working with the bodies we're just looking at them however because I learned um, the structures with my glasses on I choose to have them on during the practical because it's like state dependent kind of you know like the way that everything was encoded i don't know maybe it's a superstition yeah i'm here with jordan uh jordan how do you feel about this week uh i'm glad that we're halfway through all the stuff yeah yeah the the other ones from like yesterday and the day before were definitely worse for me so now we just got the anatomy mm -hmm. it should be super fun yes and then the didactic that we're all dreading. Oh no. <laughs> Jordy's back there. <laughs> ah, okay. I can do this. I'm confident we're doing power pose because I can totally do it. And I got this. I got it. Yes. Okay. Let's do it. Anyone? No, I'm okay. Oh, no, I'm not okay. Hey guys, we just finished. <laughs> we just finished our anatomy practical. How do you guys feel? I feel like I know anatomy. Uh, yeah. Slightly in shock, but I'll yeah. oh, oh man. Yeah. Now I have to go worry about my ostomy. Right. Oh, I did. Good luck, okay. Chris. So, You're gonna do great. Right. Yeah, How do it'll you be feel? fine. Yeah, it was harder than the last practical. It was harder. The SP, uh, they wanted to trick us. Totally good luck, Austin. But, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was kind of like. It was challenging, it was spicy, juicy, uh, definitely were trying to trick us. And you know what's funny is that I said I was going to wear my glasses because that's how I like studied anatomy was like with my glasses on. I forgot to wear my glasses. It's rough. We got coffee to treat ourselves <laughs> after that practical. And then we have our lecture. That was fascinating. That was, uh, I don't have the capacity for anything right now. I was studying while we were in that mandatory thing and I'm like realizing how much I feel like I don't know. I feel like I know absolutely nothing. So it's like terrifying. My stress level is at like four zillion right now, which really sucks. Like I don't feel good. I feel like I'm gonna just like yak. Um, I was like looking at lecture slides and, and then everything's just a blur, so. I don't really know what to do at this point just because I feel like my brain is like mush um, I really hope I pass tomorrow like I really hope I can just get by so we'll see I need to study the rest of the night I don't know if I'll check in with you guys later but um, 
definitely I'll see you in the morning if I don't see you later today. All right. Good morning, you guys. It's Thursday. Uh, it's test day. I'm so incredibly like nervous. Yes, this is good. This is great. And I have much different energy than I did for my other final that I had um, a few weeks ago. That morning, I was really like, you know, kind of like bogged down and kind of in a weird mood. This morning, my, my nervousness is being bottled in a much different way. Yeah, okay, let's do it. Let's freaking do it. I'll take some of that. Okay, hey guys, so um, I'm down in like 20 minutes. There's like chaos over there, so I don't really want to stand by everyone because everyone's just like freaking out. So like when you, I don't know, it's just like really overwhelming to be around everyone freaking out at the same time and trying to like go over stuff last minute. Um, if I don't know it now, I'm not going to know it in like 20 minutes. So um, I'm just going to see how it goes. I'm either going to be crying in the next clip, I'm really happy, so wish me luck. And I'll see you guys in like three hours. I'm not mad. I'm so happy this is over for this walk. I made it. It wasn't bad. It was fine. It was like there were some good questions, but it wasn't like I couldn't do it. Yeah, it went well. I'm not crying. I'm like calm because I managed to like stay very calm throughout the whole thing and pace myself and I'm so happy. Oh. And I'm exhausted. Ooh, hi guys. So it's later, it's a few hours later. Um, last time you saw me, I think it was like right after my exam. But I finally get to go celebrate my birthday. We're going to the yard house. This, you guys know why. So my roommate, we're gonna go with a bunch of friends and eat and have a good time because I can finally breathe. So, so excited. Hi guys, we're here. We're gonna have my friends here. It was clinical. It was step two. I'm not always alone. Anyways, yeah, so we're gonna eat and have a good time. And I'll probably talk to you guys in the morning. Good morning, it's the next day. I had so much fun last night. It was really nice to just relax and hang out with my friends and like we could all just unwind and de-stress from this hectic week. Like operating at the level of stress that we were for this week is so unhealthy. Um, I'm so glad it's over and that we made it. So, um, oh, I'm so happy. Uh, it's unreal. So today, um, although I don't have to study, I do have to work. I have to film a YouTube video and edit that and I think I have to get it up tomorrow. So yeah, you guys are getting two videos this week. I just wanted to make sure that this got up because I know you guys look forward to this on Fridays and it's our thing. Thank you so much for watching this week's vlog. I just wanted to remind you guys to go check out Ana Luisa in the description box below. I have a code for you guys. It's Rachel S 10 for 10% off of your purchase. Yeah, I love you guys so much and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care of yourselves, be kind to yourselves, and continue to work hard. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye. Another night without rest. Well, I'm gonna give it my best. And hope for the best. I'll make it out of one piece. Or maybe two. And if I don't.